So we're going to get right into the show. Um, thanks for joining us. Uh, we're excited for today's show because I think that it's relevant uh, for many people. I think it'll help answer some of the questions I know that Nate and I receive on a, on a daily basis. Um, you know, and, and if you are uh, watching this on YouTube, we super appreciate uh, if you just hit that little thumbs up button, if you comment on the show, uh, that's great as well. Um, and so uh, there's a lot of noise right out there in the seller world. Um, when I first started selling on Amazon, really, if you wanted information, there was like one dedicated Facebook group. Um, there were a few like Yahoo forums um, that you could, if you guys remember the forums, you know, that you could talk about Amazon. And then there basically was, um, you know, Amazon Seller Central Forum, which can be pretty hard to navigate and pretty confusing. Three months ago, right, Nate and I started doing these weekly shows to provide content that's hopefully easily digestible. We really try to work hard at keeping them under 30 minutes because we think anything over that is just too long. And we're really trying to give good information to help sellers grow their business. Um, since we first started doing our first show, right, uh, we get a lot of sellers that approach us and they want to know how to sell on Amazon. And that question, like I'm sure a lot of you that are in the chat, I'm sure you get that question all the time as well. And a lot of times that's a hard um, question to answer because you have to send people to multiple places basically to learn, right, the different aspects. And so if someone's asking me about retail, I'll send them to one place. If they ask me about wholesale, I'll send them somewhere else. Private label, I'll say, go over here. Online sourcing, you know, I say, go over there. And it can get kind of confusing. Um, but the best place that I've learned how to sell on Amazon has definitely be, been from other people. Uh, and I'm sure many of you in the chat room could probably say the same thing that um, the most benefit, right, of learning that you've experienced is probably another person. I know for me, I paid Maggie Cuson, who's my partner in the course that I teach now on private labeling. I paid her $1,000. Um, that was two years ago. And that was to teach me how to import and private label. And I think from her help, she was able to um, cut my learning curve for, probably from what, a, what would have been like a month uh, I mean, I'm sorry, what would have been like a year to one month um, just because of the great information. It was I, I knew exactly who to go to. Um, and so that was a real benefit to me. And so I was, you know, a thousand dollars was no brainer. And I've made hundreds of thousands of dollars, you know, just from her being able to teach me that information. So having one person to go to with all my qu uh, questions made it a whole lot easier. Um, and so this is what Nate and I, we've come up with a program that we think is going to provide the same type of ease and speed when it comes to learning how to sell on Amazon effectively. Um, this has actually been one of the hardest products I've worked on. And I'll just say too, I forgot to say that at the beginning, my voice is actually going out. I was at a basketball game last night for one of my former students. A uh, real, uh, real quick story. This student's a senior now. Um, we were house parents before I started selling on Amazon. We worked with at-risk kids. This kid was cut his freshman year from the basketball team. He lived with us. He came home. I can remember him crying in the office, and he wanted to quit the school. He loved basketball so much. He wanted to quit the school. He wanted to go back to uh, Harrisburg and play there because he knew the coach, and he knew he could make the team there. Um, and so I, I just you know, kept talking with him, said, you know, stick with it. And he actually worked on his game harder than anybody that I've known. And now he's a senior. Anyway, last night was the first playoff game. Last game, he scored 28 points against Harrisburg, the team that he would have went on. So that's why my voice is out, because I was yelling so much at, at the last basketball game. So hopefully I can uh, make it through this. So uh, this project of um, this program, this course that Nate and I have come up with, is one of the hardest products that I've ever worked on. Um, and, uh, and so I think it's going to be a really good one. Nate and I are going to continue to put out right great content and the weekly shows like this one, um, as well as great informational blogs. I've been doing video right for the last three years. And I'm going to continue to do that. But we wanted to put a program together that's a one-stop shop. Um, that's a comprehensive step-by-step -step program for those who want to dive deeper, faster, and easier. Now, I will say this. It, it, like our program is not a get quick rich program. 
and and the only, I'd still say the two main ingredients, just like with Tyron, the kid I just talked about, the two main ingredients to run a successful business, I always say is grind and grit. If you have grind and grit, right, to push through something, you're going to be successful at whatever you want. Just like this kid, this kid was balling, right? He wasn't that good. He didn't have much talent. But now he worked. He worked harder than any student I've ever seen. And now he's the best player as a senior on his basketball team. But it was grind and grit. Um, and so, you know, as we talk about this program, I always want to put that out there. I think that the information is phenomenal. I think it's going to cut the learning curve, right, um, especially for new sellers. But the two ingredients that you got to add to everything, right, that you do, you got to add grind and grit. Um, and so, Nate, I'm just going to hand it over to you to go over um, some of the uh, – go over, go through some of the program and kind of give the why um, about why we chose to set it up the way we did. Sure. Yeah. Thanks, Andy. Um, I'll just say that I, going back to what you started with, I can remember starting out selling on Amazon, like a lot of people that are approaching us, a lot of people probably in the chat here and that watch us, you know, when you're first getting started and we got started a couple of years ago, um, at first you're just researching issues and trying to get the basics down. Um, and when we started, like you mentioned, there was a lot of uh, sifting through the internet, uh, going through a couple limited groups, but there really wasn't much out there. And there was hardly any YouTube videos. I think, I, I don't know if there was barely any YouTube videos out there that were really helpful um, in the topics that we would look for actually. And so a lot of the time we spent was just trying to figure out things um, on our own. So I remember spending just hours trying to figure out stuff that you know, seems simple once you get it down, um, but without any kind of help or guide, uh, it was really just figuring out it all out on your own, and it really took a lot of time. So that was, you know, a couple years ago, and there was stuff out there, just not as comprehensive and detailed as there is now. That's one of the reasons, like Andy said, um, that he started doing uh, live shows probably three years ago now. Um, every week was to help people to get those kind of resources. And that's what we've been trying to do here with the Slams on Bros weekly shows, just free information to help people out every week. Um, because you can figure out stuff on, you can figure out stuff on your own, but usually it's just a lot slower um, or you don't get the right information. Uh, so for example, I remember one of the things I struggled with um, my whole first year and even, even recently was how, how to keep your account metrics looking good, how to make sure your account health is right. Um, and so Scott just did a webinar for us, right, a couple of days ago. And you can see that in the group. If you didn't get a chance to watch that, you can uh, ask for that in the group and we'll get you a link to it. Um, but we recently did a show about, you know, your account health, customer feedback, and a lot of the questions that people have involving that. Uh, so now there's, you know, a good resource for that out there. Um, but that's just a type of thing that, you know, if you don't have a specific webinar or source to go to, can be difficult to understand and know it all, um, especially if you're just starting out. And so just looking back when we were getting started, I would sometimes, like Andy said, go to the Amazon seller forums. And they may be better now, but I know when I would go to them a couple years ago, it was either just a clutter of bad and good information mixed together. Sometimes you'd get an Amazon representative actually to come in to kind of clear it up. Sometimes they didn't know exactly the answer or what they were talking about, it seemed like. And then there was also just a lot of negativity in there. So I don't know if it's changed, but the Amazon seller forums before was always just a lot of negativity from the people that were in there. Um, and they a lot of times made you feel stupid if you asked a question. So that was the type of resources that we looked at um, or had to use sometimes before. And thankfully, there's enough out there now that I haven't been to the Amazon seller forums in a while. Um, but those are the types of things that we'd like to improve on. So I'm going to get into the specifics of the program that Annie's talking about and where you can find that in just a little bit. Um, but one of the core things that every Amazon seller needs to be aware of are all the resources that are at your fingertips now. Um, because if you're starting out or even if you've been selling for a while, it is super important to be a, aware of the resources that are out there, the information and data that you have available. So even just things like the best seller rank, Keepa, the Amazon seller app, Jungle Scout, Inventory Lab, um, and tons of other tools that are out there. Um, not everyone knows about those, especially if you're just getting started. And to really understand those tools and how they can help your business is really important. And almost every seller uses some kind of tool to help their business to um, improve it in some way, 
but not everyone knows, you know, all the tools that are out there and which ones are actually, you know, really helpful for their business. Cause now there are so many tools out there that some of them aren't as necessary. Um, and you can kind of get bogged down with too many if you're looking at too many of the tools that are available. So we really try to make a point in the program to let you know which tools we feel are helpful getting started, which are kind of the essential tools we call them. And uh, we really put a focus on that because it can help you improve your business so much. And what it really gets down to is finding good inventory and making smart purchasing decisions. Uh, because if you're not finding good inventory and you're not making good decisions and you're not working hard, it doesn't matter if you have all the tools in the world because uh, you're going to not be making a profit. And that's what I know I am at least in this force to make a profit for selling on Amazon, um, not just to do it, even though it is fun sometimes too, but you know, to run a business. So because there's so much information out there, you have to be able to, one, sift through the bad and the good information, and two, you have to deal with increased competition from other sellers. So for those of you who are just starting out, know that the competition is you know, more than it was a couple years ago, even when we started, because there's so much information that is out there that uh, you, know, you really deal with uh, more information that's uh, you know, available. So because this information can be really found by so many people, you have to be able to sift through the good and bad and you have to realize that you're going to have to compete with other people that are utilizing all these tools. So someone might decide one day, um, hey, I want to sell on Amazon and they sign up for an Amazon account, but they never join a Facebook group uh, like Slamazon Bros. They never watch any YouTube videos like we put out every week and other people have on YouTube. Uh, they never take any courses or read any books. And it's really hard for them to compete with those people who are utilizing these tools. And it's really hard um, for them to stay motivated. And more often than not, these people are going to either um, not grow as fast as they could or kind of give up. Um, I know when I was starting out, if I didn't have even just a couple of Facebook groups that I was in, and if I didn't have Andy to rely on for some help, um, I never would have been able, I probably would have given up one, but I never would have been able to grow at the rate that I was. Uh, so you can become a successful seller on your own. Um, it's usually just more difficult uh, and more often than not, um, it can get you know frustrating. So we, we continue, like we said, to have people who are coming to us every day who are PMing us and asking for the best way to get started. And we've been talking to Slamazon Bros group and helping out with that um, and, and just seeing where people are getting stuck in the process. Um, but we have a lot of empathy for people that who are PMing us and it's clear that they've skipped entire steps in the process. So people who are private labeling and they're coming to us and saying, you know, I've bought all these products, um, but they never went into, they never took the time to decide to see if the products are actually selling. They, they don't really understand the best seller rank. Um, so sometimes when these people come to us, we kind of cringe and we say, you know what, we, we'll, we can try to help you, but you almost stipped, uh, skipped an entire step in the process that really makes it difficult um, to recover at least where you're at right now. Doesn't mean that you can't keep doing things and improve, um, but if you skip entire steps in the process, sometimes it can be a challenge or you can just lose a lot of time or money, which obviously none of us want to do that. Um, so yeah, creating promotional codes is just one example of something that people come to us and they're trying to do and they don't even really know what they're doing. And that can be result in a big mistake if you're not doing it. Um, so, so we really you know, want to help these people. We've been helping a lot of people in the group. I think there's been a lot of good conversation in there. Um, but that's why we've been working hard on this specific program that we think is going to take you from a good starting place um, and really take you through each step of the process that we use in our own business to grow. Um, and we are really excited about a related project as well. I'm just going to touch on real quick and I'll throw things back to you, Andy. Um, but a mastermind group that we've been working on um, that we're going to be coming out with uh, and just a little information on this, but the, a mastermind group that we've created that's going to be separate from our current Amazon Bros group. And uh, this group is really going to have an ongoing support system of current and relevant ideas. Um, we're going to share best practices of current relevant information, success story and tips. Um, we're going to have regular interviews with uh, expert Amazon sellers that are um, really, you know, well versed in their specific topics on Amazon um, in their respective field. So I'm going to we're going to touch on that in a little bit. And at the end, I'll go over the program a little more. Um, but Annie, I'm going to throw it back to you and just uh, so you can give us a little more information um, 
you know, about the program and some of the things that you've been doing as you've uh, gotten started selling. Sure. Thanks, Nate. So I'll just talk about a little bit like the experts and I think why that's important. You know, that, that word mastermind gets thrown around a lot. And uh, we could probably substitute that word with community. Uh, if you've watched any of my videos, you know that I'm a huge community fan. You know, I, I um, credit a lot of my success to the community and the people that I've reached out to and, and really um, got allegiance with is what I call it. Uh, and, you know, I always say you got to be careful about um, who you're going to follow. You got to be careful about who you're going to make allegiances with. Uh, but I know for me, the community has been a huge piece um, that has been able to help me and really help me accelerate the growth. And so, you know, one of the things that we're going to do is we're going to bring in experts. They're going to do webinars with us on a weekly, biweekly basis. One of the cool things I've been able to do is establish some great relationships uh, with experts in the Amazon seller space. Now, here's the weird thing. When I was growing up, right, I had a lot of friends. I used to drive my parents crazy because I would always be bringing people over the house. You know, I never thought in a million years that that um, gift, I guess, that I had would um, help me in any way when it comes to um, business success. I just didn't understand it. You know, in middle school and high school, you're not thinking about what you're going to do business wise. Um, but for me, I love people. That's just one of the things I do. That's why I lived as a house parent for 15 years with 12 at-risk high school boys because I love being surrounded by people. Um, and, uh, and so as I've, became, as I've sold on Amazon full-time for two years, I love going to conferences and I just love asking questions and talking to people. And that's really helped me to be able to know some folks that really are knowledgeable. So I just did a webinar yesterday with Greg Mercer. Um, if you sell on Amazon, you might know who he is. He's the creator of Jungle Scout. Um, and he provided what I think, um, he provided the members of my private label course probably the best webinar that I've done in the last two years on how to source private label products um, and specifically using his app, which I think is the best tool out there. Um, and so, and that he did that in 45 minutes. And so now listen, I've done a lot of videos, right? In the last two years, I've done a lot of interviews, but this guy came in because this is where he lives every single day. And, uh, and he, in 45 minutes, he provided phenomenal content that I know the members of my course, if they take that content, it's going to help them grow their business. And so we're going to bring in people like Greg and others who are really experts in, their, in the Amazon seller uh, space and especially experts in their particular field. Um, and I think that's important because the marketplace changes, right? It's changed dramatically in the two years that I've been selling full time. You know, two years ago when I started selling private label products, you could basically find a product that's selling on Amazon that had good demand and you could copy it exactly. You could just get your brand on that product and not add anything to it and your product would sell because there wasn't a lot of competition. But since that time, since two years ago, that's changed. And so like what I tell people now, those days are beginning to end where you can just copy somebody's product. You have to tweak it. You have to change it. You have to add something to it. You have to bundle it to set your listing apart because the marketplace is changing and because the Amazon sales channel is changing and because there's increased competition. Um, and so being able to have folks that are living as um, in their fields come in, you know, and talk about those changes is huge. And so that's one big piece that we're going to be able to do in that. Um, some of the webinars that we're going to do in, in this program, I'm going to teach exactly from my Amazon seller account. And so you're going to be able to see when we're talking about Seller Central, you'll see the exact way to set certain things up because I'm going to teach right out of my account, which again, if you've been selling on Amazon for any amount of time, no one does that. All right. Everybody keeps their product to themselves because they're scared, right? Someone's going to steal it. Now, this is my deal. I will open that up. If you join the course, you're going to have to sign an NDA. 
um, because it, we're going to try to protect my products as much as possible, but I'm willing to share right out of my account if it's going to help provide you some very concrete examples that might spur your imagination. So we're going to do that. And I think that's different. Nobody does that. All right. Um, and so I'm going to share some of the mistakes um, that I made. You know, hopefully you'll be able to learn and not make the same mistakes. I have a mistake. Uh, that I, it cost me $10,000. Um, and so, you know, you can imagine that was painful. Um, I woke up one morning, it happened when I was sleeping and, uh, it was so painful. I wanted to puke in the toilet, right? Uh, you can imagine it's, it was in the, what happened. It was just like taking $10,000 in cash and flushing it down the drain. All right. And so, you know, I'm going to share like how you can prevent that. And specifically in regards to private labeling, um, and this is something, listen to this, that mistake is something that happens every day because I talked to the reps in Seller Central when I was going through it and they said every day, multiple times they're getting calls and it's something real easy to change. So, you know, we're going to not only share that, but we're going to share other things, um, other pitfalls that we may have stumbled into that hopefully we'll be able to expose so that the folks that are in this group don't fall into those same ones as well. Um, you know, I think another benefit is that we're sellers, right? We make a living selling products on Amazon, okay? Um, I live Amazon. If you ask my kids, what is the word that comes out of my mouth the most? They will say Amazon. If on Facebook, right? So a little bit ago, you could do this little uh, thing on Facebook and it showed like the most words that you used. What do you think my most words were? They were Amazon was right in the middle, all right? Um, because that's just where we live. Nate and I, we, um, we enjoy it. We definitely love doing this for the last three months. We've been working on this program and we're so excited about it. We've been staying up till 12 at night and we get up at four, four 30 in the morning to try to, uh, we've been putting this thing together and it, and it, it definitely has been a lot of work, but it's also been a lot of fun because it's where our passion is right now. Um, and so you're going to be learning from people that are actively selling. My, my goal is to double my revenue every year. The first year I sold full time on Amazon, I did 420,000 in 2015, I did 875,000 this year, 2016, I want to do 1.7 million because I think the potential is there. Right. Um, and I, that's where my business is. And so I want to keep pushing and I want to keep increasing in that area. Um, and so, you know, we hope that through our ability to, um, you know, communicate with you through this program that, that you'll be able to pick up on some of the very things that we've done, um, to help our business scale up in that kind of way. So, you know, I, like I always do, I just caution you, um, to be smart about the people you choose to learn from. There are a lot of internet marketers, right, trying to cash in on how to sell on Amazon. And my warning always is to be wise about who you choose to learn from. Um, I'm obviously biased. I think that our course is going to be great. I think it's going to help a lot of people grow. Um, fantastic Amazon businesses. Um, and so if this is something that you're interested in, uh, I definitely encourage you to check it out. But like I said earlier, Nate and I are going to continue to do this show on a weekly basis, right? You don't have to do this program. If you want to take more time, right, to learn the business, you can do that. But if you want to dramatically um, increase uh, the, the learning, uh, I'm sorry, if you want to decrease the learning period, then a program like this is going to help you do that. Uh, and so that's my uh, spiel on it. Nate, I'll hand it to you. Yeah, I'll just spend the last couple minutes here um, saying, you know, what this is and who it's for, really. It's for people who are, one, getting started selling on Amazon. So if you're new within the last couple months um, and you're getting started or you haven't even gotten started yet and you want to get into it, this is for you. And it's also for sellers who are currently selling, but they're only in one area of selling. So they might only do retail sourcing or online sourcing, and they're really looking to get into private label, for example. This is for those people as well. And what this is, is the actual program course is hosted on Teachable, which is a teaching platform. It basically walks you step by step. And if you go to the website, you'll see some screenshots. I'll give you the link here in a minute. Um, but some screenshots of um, not all of the information, but a few of the sections um, basically just walks you step through 
step by step from registering your account. Um, and you can skip that section if you're already into that. Um, but for those who need to do that, and then it basically takes you through the entire process that Andy and I use to acquire inventory, to make purchasing decisions. Um, and basically, you know, what the type of inventory that we sell on Amazon. Um, so it, it takes you through the whole process. We feel that it's really good because it's the exact methods that we use. This isn't, you know, just a, um, you know, kind of a formula that might work for some people. Um, it's the exact step-by-step -step process that we take every day in our business. And then if you join the course, you also have access to the group that we were talking about, the community or mastermind group, where we'll be sharing our ideas that are current every single day. So that'll be helpful going forward for people who are looking for the most recent information, for people who you know don't want just the basics, but want the up-to-date um, opinions. And basically, we're going to be doing interview or interviews with sellers um, on a weekly or bi-weekly basis that are also, that's also going to help that process give you a fresh look at things. So um, I'll post the link here in the chat um, or, or you'll be able to see it just on the video if you're watching on YouTube. That's to go to the page, uh, the landing page for the program. You can basically look at all the information in there. We have three versions of the program, uh, basically all the same content, but you get a couple additional uh, pieces or value benefits if you order the to second and third one. Basically, every single one gets access to the program we're talking about, all the information. They all get access to the mastermind or community group, whatever you want to call it, um, at different time periods. Um, and then for those people who want to join the mastermind community group um, and don't want to take the course, we're also going to have an option for that. Um, if you do a short little interview with us, and again, like Andy said, if you um, basically fill out a non-compete agreement or a non-disclosure agreement just because Andy is going to be sharing information exactly from his account. But yeah, the program's going to walk you through the basics. It's going to give you a good foundation. It's going to tell you the essential tools that we use that we think are really great for your business. It's going to go through the entire private label process from start to finish. Um, and then also we're going to be including updates and changes as, they, as those come on. Um, it goes through wholesale, um, basically five steps of wholesale, we call it, um, and good for people who are wanting to get started and see the basics of wholesale. And then it goes through online sourcing, how you can source products right from your home and then send them into Amazon or utilize prep and ship companies as well. So we go through all that information. It's a video course. There is some text in it, but most of it is videos. Um, and then you also have access to the um, exclusive group, like we we're talking about, where Andy and I are going to be posting content answering questions on a daily and almost hourly basis in there. Um, so people have full access to, to that group as well if you join the program. Uh, but just check out, check out the page. So go to the link, check out the page, see if this is for you. It's not for everyone. And like Andy said, it's not a get rich quick scheme. It's what we do every single day. It's taken us years to build up our businesses. Um, but we don't think it necessarily has to take that long because we, we know sellers who have started in the last six months and are doing awesome sales levels and are making a really good profit. And these are the people who are utilizing the resources, programs like ours. And, and like Andy said, we're biased. We think this is going to be good for people. But check it out. See if it's for you. If it's not, we encourage you to continue watching us on a weekly basis. We enjoy doing these shows. And we're going to be doing shows going forward that um, are, you know, informational shows that aren't just about this that are giving you actual pieces of information that you can work with. Um, so go, go to the program page, go to slamsonbros.com, check it out um, and see if it's right for you. And then send us a PM on Facebook, ask us in the Slams on Bros group, any questions you have. And then also Andy, uh, we're going to be doing a live webinar this Sunday. I don't know if you have the link for that, uh, but it'll be in the Slams on Bros Facebook group for anyone that's in there. Um, check it out. We'll do a live webinar where you can actually ask us questions about the course um, and the program. Um, but anyone that's interested, you can go there. It's available now. Um, we're excited to have people try it. And uh, we really feel it's going to be helping people to grow their business. Um, Andy, I think that's all I have about it. Um, I'm excited for people to, to get into this. And then, like I said, we'll be answering questions in the Facebook group. But really, we just want people to be able to grow their business at an accelerated rate and to cut the learning curve. So I think that's all I have. Anything else you want to add to that? No, nope, that's it. Everyone have a great week and uh, have a great rest of your Wednesday. All right. See you guys in the group. Thanks.